you will, and that settles it. Remember the circumstances of Lincoln. He lost eight elections. Okay, now you lose one election. I get it. Okay, you lose one election. That's enough to break your heart. He lost eight elections. All right, that's consistency and persistency. It's the sandpaper that'll sand away any obstacle in your path. He failed twice in business. Oh my gosh, I know what it's like to go bankrupt. He failed twice in business, had to file bankruptcy. It took him 17 years to recover. He suffered a nervous breakdown. And after all that, after all of that, failing at business twice, losing eight elections, a nervous breakdown, 17 years to recover. The man became one of the greatest presidents of our history. I'm telling you, speak to your mountain. He spoke to his mountain. Eight times he failed at running for presidency and he kept saying, I will be the greatest president yet. What are you saying? That's what Lincoln said, what are you saying? He fell twice in business and got back up. Suffered a nervous breakdown. 17 years it took him to recover. And after all of that, became one of the world's greatest presidents. I want you to know that it's possible that you can live your dream. You saw that angel, see your VP5. See that level of income that you want. See a healthy body. See a healthy environment for yourself. Use your imagination. Like George Lucas said, you can't do it unless you can imagine it. Imagine yourself being in optimal health, unequivocally, optimal health, financial security. See yourself, imagine it. Exercise your imagination because like Albert Einstein said, imagination is greater than knowledge because imagination is endless. Remember, the greatest danger for most of us lies not in setting, not in setting our aim too high and falling short. No, 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 that's not it. But setting our aim too low and hitting the mark of too low. Set your sights high. Aim high and do it. Like Nike, just do it. Remember, like I said, the greatest danger of most lies not in setting our aim too high and falling short. The greatest danger for us is in setting our aim too low and achieving that mark. Set your aims high and do it. Like Michelangelo, see your angel and in your marble carved until you set it free. You can, you will, and that settles it. You can, you will, and that settles it. Remember that you are invincible, unstoppable, too powerful to be defeated, too powerful to be overcome. You are incapable of being conquered, defeated or subdued. You are more than a champion. You are more than a conqueror. You are a champion, you are unstoppable. And I want you to know that I believe in you. I'm praying for you. I got your back every single day. I want you to show up, to grow up. I want you to reach in the lion's mouth. I want you to shatter through your glass ceiling, reach in the lion's mouth unapologetically and take what belongs to you. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Michael Diamond, international motivational speaker, master sales trainer, and expert in personal development. I do ask of you that it's time for you to see your angel in the marble car until you set it free. Remember to shoot for the galaxies and you will dance among the stars. My name is Michael Diamond and I'll see you in the winner's circle. Wow. 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 Powerful, powerful. Guys, won't you guys unmute yourself? Show Good some grief. love, for Mr. Michael Diamond. Oh Thank my you God. so much. Diamond. Thank you. Thank you for that. Thank you, Mr. Diamond, Thank you for that energy. Wow. Oh, I was Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you. Praise God. Power to the people. Teach your mouth. I feel good about myself. 
I feel good about myself. I, I say that in the worst I feel situation. Good about myself. When I lost that wallet, I'm telling y'all right here. I said I feel good about myself, and my mind said you lying. You don't feel good about yourself. You feel like you a fool. You done lost that. I said you better shut up, you little ball head monkey. I feel good about myself. <laughs> Well, um, it'll mean a lot to me, uh, Mansa Jamil. I'm so proud of you. If you could give everybody just a minute, I'd like to hear from all of you. I put a lot of work into this. I just want to hear how this message speak to your mouth and impacted you. Okay, go ahead and uh, 777 if you want to unmute yourself. Yo, I'm I'm muted. Muted. Okay, go, go ahead. ahead. Start go off ahead, with Tony. Go ahead, Tony. I appreciate it. I got my man Blair Thomas on here with me. Me and Blair were just talking for about an hour today on dealing with a few folks that we're trying to drag along and pull along with us. And we were dealing with just that one thing right there where that frustration come in that I'm trying to get to expert before August 31st is up. Had a couple of speed bumps this week, but you know what? I got to keep it moving. And I just appreciate this message so much. It was timely. I'm glad Blair was able to jump on and I appreciate you brothers. I hope I can get a recording of this. And sir, thank you again, Mr. Diamond. You're so welcome, sir. Thank you so much. You know, over the years, raising four kids, having multiple disappointments and celebrations, you know, it's something you ingrain in you because you're gonna have those speed bumps, continue to speak positivity when you get negativity. 